was uh, Monterey Jack, and I didn't want to use that today. So we're gonna just put this in here. I don't want to be putting too much, but to each its own. We're gonna also put in our ham. We're gonna put in our ham. And we're gonna give it a rough chop. All right, we're gonna put in our tomatoes. Gonna put in our bacon. Got all this crispy bacon here. I'm make a chopped salad. So good, so yummy. All right, rough chop. I hear that crunchy bacon. the rest of our tomato. I didn't realize I had missed them. Move all this back to the center of our cutting board. And my cabinet is clean. It's been wiped down with pine salt and Clorox. Allowed to air dry for the disinfecting time. So no worries. <laughs> now we're going to put in our boiled egg. Just going to grab that boiled egg. I already kind of gave it a rough chop. Okay, well now we're going to chop it up some more. All right. So now we're going to put our bowl right here, and we're just going to dump this in this big salad bowl. I hope I don't drop any of this. It looks so good. Get all of that off your cutting board. Ooh, yes. Yeah. And if you want to add some black pepper uh, to your salad, I'm looking for my black pepper right now. Here you go. You can put that. Now, some people like to just use like a table seasoning, and that's fine too. But I wanted to use my Uncle Chris because I love my Uncle Chris seasoning. So here's our chopped salad, our chopped cob salad, bacon, egg, cheese, tomato, ham, and spinach in there. Ooh, look how colorful it is. Look how healthy it is. It's going to save your life. <laughs> All right, so now let's clean our cabinet off and we're going to get started with our rosemary butter uh, grilled cheese sandwich. So I'm just going to clean my countertop off really quick so we can get started with that. Clean that off. All right. Wash my hands. Dry them off. <laughs> All righty. So I have some butter here in my microwave. Just some melted butter. I have some rosemary seasoning here. Now this is dry rosemary. If you want to use fresh rosemary, then go for it. But I'm going to use dry rosemary today. And when I'm using dry seasoning, seasoning, seasonings like this, I like to put them in my hand first. And I like to rub them into whatever I am cooking just to release some of the flavor uh, really good. So if you have a dry seasoning, just rub them in your hand. Get that those flavors going really, really well. All right, 
So I have my waffle maker here today. Y'all know I love my waffle maker. I absolutely love it. We're gonna mix together that butter and rosemary. Gonna mix it all up. Now you guys don't judge me, but I have done triple layer grilled cheese sandwiches before. We're not doing it today, but if you want to use like a third slice of bread in there, it's absolutely up to you. I always use wheat bread. It's my preference. That's what I grew up on. So if you want to use white bread or uh, some type of nine grain, whole wheat, whatever you want to do, fine. But this is honey wheat bread that I'm using. So today the cheeses that we are using for our grilled cheese sandwich is mozzarella and cheddar. So, we're going to get a slice of cheddar cheese and put it right on there. We're going to get a handful of mozzarella cheese. Oh, let me, if I can get it, there we go. We're going to put some mozzarella cheese right on top of there. Get our second piece of bread and just stick it right there on top. Hold it tight. Stick it in your butter, rosemary mixture. Yes, yes, yes. And put it on your waffle maker. And then get it. And give it a flip. And when your green light comes on, guess what? It'll be ready. So give us a few minutes and that's gonna grill up real nicely. And I'll come back and show you the plated product of our chopped salad and our rosemary butter grilled cheese. Alrighty, here's our rosemary butter waffled grilled cheese sandwich. Oh my goodness, look at it. It looks so freaking pretty. <laughs> Let me give it a cut because I know my girls are going to say, can you cut it in half? So we're going to just give it a cut in half. Oh my goodness. Oh, I didn't do a good job of cutting it. <laughs> Look at that. Yes, 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 yes. Ooh, yes. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get some of our salad. Uh-oh. Need a little bit of assistance here. Get some of this salad. Put it in my bowl here. There we go. I'm gonna top mine off with some ranch dressing. There we go, and I'm just gonna put half of the grilled cheese sandwich right in there with it. Check it out, you guys. A chopped cob salad with spinach, tomato, bacon, ham, and egg. We seasoned it up with our steak seasoning and our rosemary uh, butter grilled cheese sandwich that we put in our waffle maker. It looks so good and it's going to taste so good too. I am sure of it. So let's give it a try. You know I gotta give it a try. Get a little bit of everything in there, bacon and spinach. Mm-hmm. Mm. Absolutely delicious. Give it a try, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Quick and easy meal that anybody can make. Thank you guys. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. And once again, thank you for all of your support. Y'all have a great day, okay? Give this salad a try. Take another look at it. Look how pretty it is. It's healthy. Eat your vegetables. Bye. <laughs>